welcome back to the channel now people are saying all of a sudden after the uk privy council quashed vibes cartel's murder conviction everybody and them cousin have something to say recently we are from cargo queen africa and even an individual who some say was a farmer inmate at a correctional facility where vibes cartel was host we even hear the artist's wife i say she was unaware that jamaica was full of so much liars without a law degree and some say they believe an attempt is being made to paint vibes cartel in a negative light so that a retrial is granted even though defense attorneys have stated that based on the actions of the dpp there will be no retrial now this man we are called brown man says something very interesting he said him no know vibes cartel where him know vibes cartel among no through music and interviews and the fans are saying, no matter where you hear people like Queen Africa or Cargo might say about Vibes Cartel, them don't know him personally. And they have no secret information about the dance hall entertainer. Yeah, I'm going hear from the individual, Brown Man, and they will continue reasoning. Look and listen. I don't personally know him, because you're one of them say, yeah, what the fuck, you don't know the man, are you talking like, you're right, I don't know him. You see, I only know him through his music, I only know him through his interviews. Only know him through what people say about him. Oh, thanks, Sir P. <laughs> you know, because Sir P have a whole lot to say. I may not see nobody. I call out Sir P. I talk about, yo, you know, you're wrong. See me receipt, you have to show you say you're wrong. You see me? I may not see nobody else do that. You see me? One and people might have tried a thing, but they're not stand up to him, I say. You understand? And then I say every time when I come up with something, Sir P just find the next thing to boof buff. Everybody not them fierce with it. You see me? Sir P not depend where on the depend. See? Sir P don't tell you where him come from already. You see? So oh yeah, keep gonna keep giving the man ammunition. You think the man would have gone so if them changes that it have gone, if that if that move so. I want to make him say, me if I can say, yo, at least it sound like him keep it real. You know, him keep it 100, him keep it not a migo. You understand? So, before I come, I appreciate the comments, them, you know. Don't get me wrong, I appreciate the love, you know. Who I can answer, answer them back. You know, who may not answer, but you know what you got. Catch you next time. Uh, say something more interesting. <coughs> you see? But just, <coughs> for those who are going to come, I know you have enough dance people out there you see so for those who are gonna come up here and attack foolishness you see for me answer them and them thing there I'm answer you now because it's funny you see me a bad mind cartel really think about that my friend you know that's not even possible you know for me bad mind anybody you know especially somebody in cartel position you think would I want to trade position with him the sick in your head no matter how much money him have you out, eh? you that trade position with him, tell me now. The person who met the comment that said my bad mind, you with a trade position with him right now, eh? you that go lay down with him there right now and give him the your spot where you there. Help call the woman there, tell her, say, yo, you want to trade with him. You that do that, eh? since you love him so much and me bad mind. No, I don't think so. You see me? So stop your foolishness. You understand? Suck me, I tell the man. You see? Try to help the man out. Calm down. Humble yourself. You see? Draw your energy. You see? Send a different word out to your fan them. You see? And not because me say it first. Don't mean say you still can't write the woman a letter. Write her a letter. You. You. Make sure you're from you. Mega. That you want to hear. Make people hear from you. The real thing. You know, now you say them say you change and a god, you say, yeah, let me hear it then. People will know. You can't fool the people no more. You understand? So do the right thing, my nigga. Yeah? And only in the comments. Easy on yourself with the foolishness. My man, not for not foolishness. You hear that? Now, one thing for sure. When the case was played out and people get the ear, all the different things that took place during the trial things that people never readily remember certain things that people were not aware of 
as when Bird Samuels pointed out the situation when the judge called both defense and the prosecution to the judge's chamber after the jury scandal took place. We don't know if we never just we never hear or we never remember, but the first time we hear about that, I when Bird Samuels talk about it. I will me hear the details I when Cliff Hughes interview the DPP. So I don't know if other people didn't know about that. I never know. Now, the defense attorneys are pointing out, say, yo, it might just sound like a simple formality to people who don't have a law degree. Because we get to realize recently, holy pala you there. But what you going on? The defense attorneys, the individuals who actually go school for law, who actually have a law degree, they have said that this scenario, which is not the only instance of Vibes Cartel not getting a fair trial, but it was a major one, and the one that the UK Privy Council chose to use as their point of reference to say, clearly this wasn't a fair trial. They are saying that it's not a simple situation. The fact that the prosecution knew, and yes, the defense knew also, but the defense was not prosecuting an individual. The defense was defending. Now, we we'll talk about court integrity. That has to be up, held or uphold, or uphold it, whichever way you want to term it, by the judge and the prosecution. And when the integrity of the court is brought into question, it is normally based on actions done by the prosecutor or the judge. Our judges, whichever if it's a tribunal or, you know, just trial. And that is why I believe the defense is saying that they do not think the court of appeal will be thinking of a retrial. Resources wise, evidence wise, you know what I mean, wally part of cases, things of that nature. Now the people also say, why them entertain and them people are come out, come say this? Why? If they now have nothing good for sell them, just not, not say nothing. Just leave the matter alone. Carry on with their lives and their endeavors. They're entertainers themselves. They now have careers and, you know what I mean? They have their own things going on. One would assume. So if you hear them forward out and attack things about the entertainer that people would consider negative publicity, people are wondering why they might do it or it benefit them. Well, fans of the artist said point to the fact that even though people are saying because of Vibes Cartel, you know what I mean, status, um, influence, achievements, creativity, talent, whatever reason you want to say, the state disliked or the system disliked Vibes Cartel. They know who also it look like are not really fans of Vibes Cartel, other entertainers. It seems that other people within the music industry are also not fans of Vibes Carter. Some had also assumed that, are speculated that some of them were happy and thought that they would be the leaders of the music scene. Something that has not happened. These individuals are not the leaders of the music scene. Some would say their level of relevance in the music scene has even dwindled. While even behind the bars, Vibes Carter level in music has continued to rise. He's still one of the most talked about dancehall artists, one of the most streamed dancehall artists, one of the most accomplished dancehall artists. You don't know what kind of title or what they want to talk about. Vibes Cartel has won it. The only thing Vibes Cartel get for dancehall on Grammy. But talk to me in the comment section. Tell me what you think. If you're new to the channel, just a pass through. Well, click the subscribe icon and then the bell icon. And of course, put it on up. Tell me what you think about what Brown Man say. Tell me what you think about what Queen Africa say. Cargo say. And tell me what you feel like they must say what they must say now. At the time when they must choose to say it. Of course, click the subscribe icon, the bell icon, and put it on all. And this is how you know you'll be notified of all fresh content as soon as fresh content is uploaded and made available for you right here on the platform. The like icon is also in close proximity to the share icon. Drop a like and boss a share. And tell a friend, tell a friend, tell them sister and them brother them for check out your check out the reasoning. And also join the discussion, the comment section of 24-7 in Never Lock It. Just be respectful and mindful of the guidelines. But other than that, drop your thoughts, your comments, and yes. Your opinions there, and we can continue the reason via the comment section. Now, until the reason again, of course, my sentiments for you and yours. I want to live, love, and prosper, and want to stay tuned. 
until we reason again.